Hi there, my name is Matthias. In today's video, I'm gonna teach you Isn't She Lovely by Stevie Wonder. We're gonna learn the whole song in the original key. This video is gonna be the first part. We're gonna talk about the chords and the finger style plucking pattern. In a separate video, I will teach you the melody. So now let's start with the chords. The first chord what we have in this song is a C sharp minor 7. So you have to do a bar on the 4th fret from the A string and uh, put your third finger on the 6th fret D string and the second finger should be on the B string 5th fret. This is the first chord. The second one is uh, F sharp 7 13. So first finger on the 2nd fret low E string, 2nd finger D string 2nd fret, 3rd finger on the G string 3rd fret and 4th finger on the B string 4th fret. The 3rd chord what we have to know is a B sus4. So 3rd finger on the low E string 7th fret pinky on the D string 7th fret, 2nd finger G string 6th fret, and B string 5th fret with your 1st finger. This is the 3rd chord, the next one gonna be E major 7, 9. So 2nd finger on the 7th fret A string, index finger on the D string 6th fret, pinky on the G string 8th fret, third finger gonna be on the B string 7th fret. So we will have two A parts, a B part and one more A. The finger style plucking pattern sounds like this. This is the A part. So let's talk about the strumming and uh, we're gonna talk about the chords in the B part later. Let's talk about the right hand now. So you have to pluck two times the whole chord after slap the guitar. The next part is plucking the whole chord except the bass. So after the bass. So we're gonna have two times the full chord after slapping the guitar, the whole chord except the bass and the bass, gonna be the last one. And for the whole song this will be the plucking pattern. Let's try with the F sharp 713. B sus 4. and E major 7, 9. Okay, now let's talk about the chords in the B part. So after we played two times the A part, um, the first chord in the B gonna be an A major 7 chord. First finger on the 5th fret low E string, third on the D string 6th fret, pinky will be a G string 6th fret and 2nd finger will be on the B string 5th fret. Ok, the next chord in the B part will be a G sharp 7 sharp 5. So 1st finger on the low E string 4th fret, 2nd finger on the D string 4th fret, um, ring finger gonna be on the G string 5th fret and pinky will be on the B string 5th fret. So the plucking pattern gonna be the same in the B part as well. The third chord in the B part is a C sharp minor 7, we talked about this before. After this, after the C sharp minor, F sharp 7 13 will be the next chord. After the F sharp 7 13 will be a B sus 4. The next chord after the B sus 4 will be an E major 7 9. And the last chord in the B part will be a G sharp 7 sharp 5. We talked about this before. Now let's practice together the whole song. One, two, three, four.
this was the whole song. If you have any questions about the strumming pattern or about the chords, leave a comment below. If you would like to learn the melody, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like and see you in the next video. Bye.